Please welcome back to my channel right here and as you can see from the title this is a bit of an update video so I mean before we go and continue if you know why not give this video a thumbs up and of course subscribe down below if you want some more of an update on beauty and everything on life and everything and be part of the beauty squad then subscribe to that channel down below and of course if you are subscribed and still here thank you so much for loving and supporting this video ring that notification bell so you will be notified with all of the disasters that is happening so let's go to the update before I kind of do an update um I know that my channel has been a bit rocky since uh, the start of the year, since uh, January of course and um, it's because of the health issues and I know I want to film like so much uh, it's been an enjoyment of mine, it's kind of a therapy for me but this past month uh, January has been really rough um, on my health um, I'm kind of I don't know what's happening to me in January like I have this kind of anxiety attacks like I've talked about my anxiety uh, openly on this uh, channel and uh, January was kind of a pretty hard blow on me um, you know how anxiety is we really don't know why it's happening to us um, on January I was having these attacks that I don't know why they're happening to me I don't know if subconsciously do my mind kind of think things that I am not aware of um, but on January I've been feeling so down in the dumps like I have uh, physically I'm so down like I want to do things but then physically I can't do them like I am always dizzy I always wanted to kind of uh, vomit or some reason like there is something churning in my stomach that I can't explain um, which is the weirdest thing I'm thinking if it's my anxiety or if it's my eyes like because I have really bad eyesight um, I kind of did something to distress myself uh, so the videos on my channel are a bit rocky like I will have uploads and I will not have uploads um, the thing is I have I always pre-film things but um, when it comes to kind of editing and everything, I do this all on my own. And sometimes when that kind of attack happens to me, I just need to lay that down. If I don't lay that down, I will be like that for the next couple of days. So, and when I do lie down, then I can't able to do anything. So, like I've been... I'm feeling this churning sensation. I feel like I'm gonna vomit. I, I can't do anything. So that's basically January for me, which is so freaking hard. I don't want to go through that again. Like, I can't. I'm going through that still, but I'm trying my best to kind of get my head out of my ass. Uh, so, to do everything. Um, like last year um so february came uh we are by the end of february now and this past week i was caught with the flu like totally caught with the flu no voice no anything um i suddenly got a flu and a fever which is i haven't got that for like a year and i suddenly got it and i was in the bed for like four days and I needed to go I was medicating myself alone and then I 
realized I got better a little bit and then my voice completely got like it's nothing and I was so scared because my lungs is a bit here and there like I have a lung problem as a kid so I was so scared that I realized that maybe there's something wrong with my lungs so I went to our doctor and I told I just got a check up because I'm scared of what ha what's happening like I got better and then I got no voice at all and I got so scared but our doctor said that it's just on my throat uh, something and I got a strep, strep infection so I needed to have antibacterial medications for the whole week which I'm still taking um, but yeah by the two day mark um, I had my voice back it's coarse but I'm still a bit dizzy with all the medications like I said sometimes pills do not agree with my system which is the craziest craziest thing uh, so that happened to me which is so like I hated having a fever and it ha my body had to remind me to have it so now after I got better my sister my little sister got the chicken pox from school which is so annoying like annoying to me like I got better and then my sister got this kind of really infectious disease like it is infectious like I'm so scared of having that because I can't quite remember if I had it as a child I can't remember and I was so scared because our doctor said if you haven't got it if you haven't got this chicken pox then there is a high risk that you're gonna get this one too so I'm like I can't have chicken pox by my age because I mean if you kind of uh, had chicken pox as a child it's kind of okay because your skin will stretch uh, but if you're 23 and you're an adult it's hard to have chicken pox by this age because you got to have to do scar creams and everything like that and oh my god I can't I just can't have I just can't have it every bump that we have on our skin we take it as chicken pox and we're scared so that week was a very hard week we had to sleep in separate bedrooms like my sister had to sleep here so i can't film because she's here um but i also got my eyes checked um and turns out my grade is higher than it was before so that's why maybe i'm having these headaches like every night I'm having a headache and I don't know why it does my body does that to me because my body knows I hate the feeling of nausea and well I don't know why it's happening to me but basically I got my eyes checked I got a new pair of lenses for my eyes and my sister is getting better um, she's still very highly contagious because you know how chicken pox can go when it's uh, near the end when the scabs are kind of pulling off her skin it's highly contagious so we're still at high risk uh, we're still scared but we kind of um, drank a cyclovir kind of medication so that if you can if you will have that it will prevent you from having it so that type of thing so I never thought in my life that we'll be treating chicken pox but then life happens to you and this happens I was trying to get my hands on L'Oreal Freshwear not a not a shade not a shade in our drugstore only the whitest one so I'm like no I think I'll wait or I'll order it online I am not sure. I have swatches on my hands um, on a coming review about a palette, but so and my computer is open, editing computer editing to do. But yeah, so I guess that's a very long kind of update on my life, what happened, but this is a long ass update. But I hope. 
it clears everything because I don't want to be, you know, just be back and just nothing explanation, nothing, everything at all. But that's it for me today. And this is the first time that I've filmed during the morning. Like you can see, like if there's a flash of light on my background, that's because the sun is in here. So I hope you like and subscribe and ring the bell um because i always be here three times a week so that is it for me this day webbies thank you so much for listening to all my rants and i will see you on my next upload Bye.